pass. Let me have fun and end pass away. Father, please. <laughs>
morning, this month. How are you? Fine, sir. Uh, actually, I'm on my way to the hospital. I hope there's no problem. My mother said I'll be going to the church. To the church? For what? She wants me to be a reverend father, and I don't want to be a reverend father. She wants you to be a reverend father? Yes, sir. And they don't want to be a reverend father. Then what did your daddy say? He's in support of it. Hmm. Your daddy is in support? That's more my reverend father. Uh, that's more my son. Uh, I will advise you to heed to the advice of your parents. But I don't want to be a reverend father. But I don't want to be a reverend. Um, I, actually, I will still go and see your father and discuss with him. But this month, your father will be good for you. This month on Kassok, they do really so. Nakamas, your father, this month, <laughs> my son. <laughs> So you'll be okay, okay? Mm. Okay. What happened to you? Yeah. Princess. Sir. Dear. Dear. As you two can see, I can no longer walk. Mm. I can no longer attend to business as usual. And the only person who could have assisted me in business, the Lord. I've taken. Oh, God. <laughs> it's okay. As it is now, Princess. Sir. I want you to carry on with my business. While you here, you stay at home and take care of her. First thing tomorrow morning, I promise you, I'll take this one to the church. Mm. Yes. You'll be fine. You will leave for us. Nothing will happen to you. You'll be fine, okay? Mm. Mm? Mm. So <clears throat> Sorry. Um, okay. So let's go. Just let me show you our apartment. So by tomorrow, we'll so pack in.
This one. Yes, Bishop. This is your new apartment. Uh, Father Peter used to live here before he was transferred. Once more, congratulations for a successful ordination as a priest. Thank you very much, Bishop. All glory to God who made it possible. And kudos to you too, who brought me up in the way of the Lord from childhood. We give God thanks in all. Why, well, young man, I bring you here to let you know three things mm -hmm. supposed to know as a priest. At your audience, speak. Good. Three things are natural to men. One, alcohol. Two, smoking. Three, organizing. If you can avoid all, then your work will be success. And I've already separated myself from the world. I will be absolutely faithful to my core. That's good. I love that. Once again, thank you very much. I'm happy for you. Thank you very much. Don't go to school. Don't you have two wives? Call them now. Why, why are you calling me? Leave me alone, too. This one should leave me alone. No, no. I was not the one that sent the door and asked them. He has two wives and he's disturbing me. I'm not resting this out because of that. I'm going to perform with them. My son had to be here. I could have been better off. I suffered enough. I wouldn't have suffered enough. <laughs> My only son this month, he wanted. But you have taken him. Oh Lord. Give me rest. Give me rest.
of the Lord be with you and be unto your market. That's never enough. What? It's never enough. Let's forget about that. I missed you. <laughs> I missed you too. Oh, you're my sweetest, the very best. <laughs> Don't worry. I've missed my honey. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Thank you. No way. No, every time you do that, every time you do that, I just can't. Oh. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> That's never enough. What? It's never enough. Let's forget about that. I missed you. <laughs> I missed you too. Oh, you're my sweetest, the very best. <laughs> Don't worry. I've missed you. My honey. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Thank you. No way. No, every time you do that, every time you do that, I just can't. Oh. <laughs> um, Thank <laughs> you. 
gentle soul of my lovely late brother, late Williams, rest in perfect peace. Amen. Amen. Um, Reverend Father Desmond. Yes, uncle. Since my lovely brother is dead, leaving you behind, as his only son, who, who supposed to take position of all his business and also take care of his family, is now a priest. Not even an ordinary priest, rather a reverend father. Uh, um, I, your uncle, Uncle Michael, 
is available. I'm going to take a position of your dad's businesses, including his properties. Uh, since you have taken the oath of celibacy, he will make a mind the Iron Doker, more mind the Ankin is an honor. But let me assure you, I'm going to take proper care of your mothers. Proper care of your mothers, I will take proper care of them, including your sisters. Uh, Vanessa and uh, Vanessa and uh, Vivian. Mm. Thank you very much, Uncle. Thank you. I sincerely appreciate your kindle heart towards this burial. May the Almighty Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit Amen. guide and protect you. Amen. Amen. Having taken the oath of celibacy. I concur with you that you take charge of that process and I promise to support you in any area I can. Uh, Father, this month, truly and indeed, you are the true son of his father. <laughs> you took after my little brother. You know, you. He, shot, he, 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 he always made everything to be easy. That is the major reason why even when I got the, the news of his uh, death, I even knew he wanted to, to die again before himself. <laughs> but all the same, I'll be there for the family. I promise. You are rejecting your father's properties. Mom. Mom, you know I can no longer participate in the things of the world. I have taken the oath of celibacy. This mm. yes, mom. Has it occurred to you that your uncle is never the right time to handle these properties? Mom, you know what? I think you should go get some rest, alright? This is not the right time to talk about this. Yes. Come on, Mom. Go rest, Mom. I'll, I'll, I'll see you later. Yes, Mom. Go rest. Yes, Mom. What have I done to myself? What have I done to myself? Eh? All these properties. Like that. Just like that. So, how is Lord going? London is as cool as it used to be, bro. <laughs> you don't need to tell me. I can see the glory of God all over you. You can say that again. Um, I am so sorry about the loss. Let his will be done. Then when we were still kids, you know, your father and my father were best of friends. And then your father introduced you as his next of kin. Little did anyone know that you were finally going to be a reverend father. <laughs> On the contrary, I'm a reverend father now. Yeah. And I know you have other documents. Of my late father's properties. And as a lawyer that you are, I know I don't have to tell you how to go about it to make sure that my uncle, who is the benefactor, gets them. Your uncle. Look. Why your uncle? The personality of the benefactor has changed and a new name has been stated. Which is my uncle's name? 
Desmond. Your late father's view clearly and boldly stated that you are his benefactor. I know. Look. Look. I have the interest of my clients at heart. And your late father's view will not be an exception. Why? What next? Don't worry. I know what's your fear. I'm going to use my legal ability to buy you more time, depending on when I'm able to lay my hands on a more formidable plan. Janet, thank you for that name. Me. Hi, this one your face looks like this. Any problem? How long do you think I can wait? Answer me. For how long will I wait until the will is being paid? I will keep on waiting for the lawyer. Hey, I am an honor, not a lawyer. I'm for an hour. When I'm supposed to have taken my position in this family, I have come to tell you. I have decided to involve, to involve our kindred. I told you, Mosu Mona, come on, let's see. Do you know who I am? Ah, ah, nine. Ah, ah, now has it gotten to that extent of him bringing the Mona into this matter? This is a family matter. For how long? For how long? Tell me, Janet. Tell me. Yeah, 
gravity. Africa. Africa. <laughs> it's all good. So, um, what do you do for? Oh, no, 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 no. You know I'm not a black man. I can't be doing something and you're doing something else. I'm not going to look at it. I'm not going to see you. All right. Um, Wait up, please. Can somebody get me a bottle of smin of ice? Okay. All right. Yeah. How are you doing? How is the here? Not easy. Not easy. Do you know something about you guys? You keep saying Africa, Africa, Africa. But when we get down here, we find out that you guys are, are you're really large. Look at how beautiful you are looking. I can't say you in Canada. Oh, I'm gonna yes. lose you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's, it's a pleasure meeting you once. I'm glad you're gonna be. Before I regard it as a polite insult. <clears throat> it's alright. You might still have some light at the end of your dark pitch tunnel or the same. Really? Come on, do not tell me. Do not tell me I want to hear. Calm you. down. Calm down before you scare away the solution. 
On a more confidential note, I don't want you to view my suggestion or either see me as an antichrist or some sort of demon. Come on, we're adults, right? There's no kid in here. I want to hear it. I want to hear that. All right. All which right. I have in mind. All right. All right. Have you considered? Um, Father Phillips. Father Phillips yeah. meets Barrister Donor, a legal practitioner. Um, he always calls me for advice whenever he has some bordering issues. Barrister Donor, meet Father Phillips. My pleasure. Good to see you. Thank you very much. Well, Mr. Donor, do you see a duty call? Yes, Pedro. Mm -hmm. And um, Father Phillips, why don't you go downstairs? Let me just change up our journey. All right, bless you, Father. Bless you, Father. All right, um, Father Phillips. My pleasure once again. Have a nice day. Thank you. Um, come on. So tell me, tell me. Now, let me go straight to the point. Have you considered artificial insemination? Lord of Jesus. Holy Mary. Artificial Insemination? Yes, of course. Like taking my sperm? Fix it into a woman to give you a child. Holy Mary. How can you have such thoughts in your mind as a Christian? God, I pray that our merciful Father have mercy upon you. You know what? You know what, Mr. Donald? Get up and leave my house because you are a bad influence on me. Jesus Christ. I thought he was a friend I can confide in. How can you have such thoughts in your mind as a Christian? Yeah, Lord Donald. Come over to war. Yes, I've made up my mind. Yes. See, I don't want to talk about it on the phone, alright? Just come over to war. Okay. Peace be unto you.
Wow, I am grateful. Like, I'm more than grateful. I'm happy. So when am I going to start? Are you not going to ask me the nature of the job? I'm sorry. So, what's the nature of the job? Miss Bloor. Yes, Mr. Bloor. I need to be totally blunt here. Okay. Can you give birth to a child for a man through artificial insemination for two millionaire? What? Artificial insemination? Father this morning, as your oath, as a priest, God forbid you from making known the sacramental penance of your members. So have I also taken an oath to keep the secret of my clients silent. Fine then. I'll send the money we agreed to your account. Make sure. Make sure you keep the terms. Don't forget I talked to you to do this. So be rest assured you have my words. Alright. I'll have to be on my way. And may the peace of the Lord be with you. So with you. Yeah, hello. Uh, come in, come on in. Gloria, how are you? Good day. Good day, how are you? Please Thank have you. a seat. How are you? Well, I'm fine. I mean the deal. Have you, have you okay? Have you gone to the hospital of Officer to see the doctor? Yes. And what did he say? Sorry. Uh. 
I am one month pregnant. Are you kidding me? Trust me. You're pregnant? You're serious? Are you pregnant? Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Sorry, sorry, I, I lost my Oh, I'm sorry. don't I'm not! Sorry. You are just crazy! This is lovely! Oh my god! You're pregnant for me? Yes. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make you happy. <laughs> I swear to god, I'm gonna make you happy. I'm gonna make you the happiest lady around. Oh, baby. Make sure you have everything you need. I God. You've just made my day! So, how much was it? I actually collected 3,005 from her. Are you serious? And she actually gave you the money. That girl. Wait a minute, Vanessa. That reminds me. Like, seriously, I'm not happy with you. About what? Vanessa, you went too far. You went as far as change your identity. That was too bad. Oh, Dad. What was that for? You don't give me that while I'm talking to you. Why what? Why, 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 why? Abiba, this is me, Venisa. This is what I want and I've gotten it. So why are you bugging me? I'm your, boy, I'm your best friend, of course. I have to be worried. When you're worried, I'm worried as well. Don't say I didn't warn you about this. You are not my mother. Hello? Darling, be sure of this. Join you about embarking on. Don't say I didn't warn you. Oh, never mind. What? Right. What did I get for you for lunch? Um, nothing. I don't think I've needed any food for this past day. Are you sure? Yes. You have come in. Hey, Dona. How are you? I'm fine. Well, you, you can go. Okay. How are you? I'm good. You're looking good. Well, that's part of my profession. <laughs> um, let's get out of business. So tell me what good news. passing away as an excuse every time I want to have a taste of you. Even more like that, I've missed you, I've missed everything about you. I just have to be for the meantime. Have you not seen two adults making out before? God. Vivian! Have you no shame? Bringing a man into your restless father's home. Did I kill father mom? Did I kill him? God. Because of that same father, you denied me of going to school. I killed him! Yeah. You know what I 
Mr. Wetton here. Leave him! Stop with you! for the past five minutes without telling me exact, exactly why you're crying. Mm. Now, officially tell me why you're crying. I want to stay off. I want to stay off campus. My friends are beginning to say some things that is not right. I'm not feeling comfortable at all. And so? I need a new apartment. I need a place to call my home and feel very comfortable. Gloria, the day you met me, did I tell you I was a property agent? Or have you walked in here to see somebody who's telling me about a house to rent, a house, an accommodation or something? You just have to do it for me. Just do it for me or else. Uh -huh. um, I, I'm looking for this boat. I'm looking for this one. Yeah. I think it's um... I want to see him. I need to see him. Oh, here he comes. <laughs> Good afternoon. No one to see him. Good afternoon. This month. What is good about this afternoon? This month. Answer me. What is good about this afternoon? When you have practically seized the weight of your father. To stop saying. Let me remind you now. Let, so, let me inform you officially and legally. This month, I will no longer wait until the will is being read before I will climb to my position. I will no longer. I get him Mr. Quazo. I will no longer wait until the will is being read before I will climb to my position. Then, if you fail to comply this month, then you have to come down to the village and explain to our kinsmen. You do no such thing. Why you go on, sir? Oh, see you. This is more defense, sir. But if you wish to, go ahead. Whatsoever happens to you, just know you cost it yourself. Why you go on, sir? What's that defense, sir? This month is not a threat. This month is not a threat. It is not a threat, uncle. For you have decided to fight the law. Why you go on, sir? This month, what's that defense, sir? Why you go on, sir? This month, I think it was still going to But let me inform you this month, you have been sold to the church. You have been sold to the church. Any single Induka, Induka, Musegi. Give to Caesar what belongs to Caesar. Give to Caesar what belongs to Caesar and give to God what belongs to God. When you get Chineke, the Chineke. When you get Caesar, the Caesar. This month, this month, we pack him on offer to go like a mother. We didn't get you naked, you get you naked. We didn't get you naked. This month, this month, mind the church activities and they allow me to handle the family affairs. Happy me and Roman. Thank you. Happy Roman. Okay, no wonder. This month, this month. Now, Uncle, leave my house at once. Eh? I said, leave my house. Why are you going to say, Ken? What's your face, sir? This month, you can't do that. Make sure you. Come down to the village and they speak to our kids, man. Here, I don't know about 
Donald, my uncle is so annoying. He came to the church quarters yesterday, telling me that I was sold to the church. You know, I don't understand. Why is he so much interested in that properties? I mean, what is he thinking? Calm down. I know what to do. Are you sure? Don't you trust me? Sure, I trust you. was very rich when he was alive. By this time, I was supposed to be in the factory. Counting millions. Monitoring all the activities of all the staff there. But this month has decided to walk hand in hand with the lawyer and seize all the properties with the excuse of until when the will is being read. Good sir. Thank you. Good morning. How are you? Um, I'm looking for one Mr. Goji. Michael. I hope there's no problem. Uh, yes, sir. I'm the one. Um, I was sent to deliver this to you. I said to him, I'm so cool. I've been expecting this type of letter, either from the bank or from my <laughs> lawyer. Yes, sir. <laughs> Here, okay, okay. Is it you me? I I I I go down. I never go Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Impossible! It is impossible! The lawyer is now ordering me to wait until he's back from his trip before the will will be read. I will not wait until you come back from your trip. It is impossible. Is this a threat? Could this be a threat? <laughs> Could this be a threat? It is impossible. It is impossible. I would accept it. This month. This month, this month, let me remind you once again, you have been sold to the church. This month, therefore, you should mind the activities of the church. Yes, we can do okay. We pray in our property. There's an honor. It is my right. This month, you have been ringing and you are still ringing around the family properties. This month, you are still lingering around the family properties after taking the oath of celibacy. Why are you this? Why you go outside the city of Fensala? Why you go outside this month? Why you are sitting in a lawyer of Fensala? Is that a threat? It's a threat. It's a threat. It's a threat. No one, you never want to say this fish cook up, sir. You try, sir. Yeah, it makes sense. I'll carry my food now. 
Babe, what's up with your friend? I mean your roommate. She's fine. For months I saw her. I be mean, she don't drop out. She's fine. Just that she lost her dad, and you know she has trouble for the burial. You know. This is exactly the same thing you told me the last time I asked after. her. You know these burial things now. She had to stay and attend to one or two family meetings, but hopefully though, she will soon be back. You mean she's not yet back? Which guy want to push her back? See me now. That's the house, though. It's official. No, you can. Hey, woman, I don't really like talking like this. This time you lose it. No, I don't care what happened. Don't say to worry, Graham. Leave your country, your relatives, your father's house, and go to the lab that I'm going to show you. I will give you a minute to send out. And they will become a great nation. I will bless you and make your name famous so that you will be a blessing. I will bless those who bless you, but I will cause those who cause you. Best man, best man, best man. Best man. I have loved you to your short and glory from you. But you have chosen to be ready 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 to be This time you are inside in your premises unexpectedly. I hope everything is alright. What the hell holds after in the red is very important to eat. Bro, Michael, you and this here proverb. You and this here proverb. As you can see, I'm going out. I mean, yes. Please, I have visit to attend. Please. My bishop, there was one after taking an oath of celibacy. Still have any business to do with family? Yes. No. What of the properties? Why all this question? Is father this month? Oh my God! Is father this month? Why you go out, sir? A single father this month go face Sarah. Why you go out, sir? A single father this month go face Sarah. Father this month has seized the properties of his late father, who happens to be my brother. The properties which I supposed to inherit as the tradition demands. That is the reason why I have come to inquire if the system has changed. The doctrine has not changed. And no one can change the doctrine. Yeah. Um, Bro, Michael, well, what I promise you that I will look into it. Please, go. Thank you, Mr. Bishop. I will do it, sir. Why do you go outside? You see, I'm just going to go outside. 
and family sense. Oh, I find this one. Spare me that crap. I've been hearing a lot about you. Especially the case of your secret baby. I know how old you we are when you came to this tabernacle of God. Now you need me to believe what I'm hearing. Which is? You mean you don't know? What business do you have with your family? What's that your father's sister's property? To be sure it's uh, Oh, stop that for Christ's sake. Just one. I forgot it that you're a servant of most high God. Just one. You're not of the world. So you say that in the Holy Bible, all oh, these things is the time of Just one. You know the church cannot control this if they hate. it. Remember, the church cannot control this if they hate. it. Yes, sir. Give back all to all these police and properties. Return it back. That's what we That's right.
Push, 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 push. How are you? I, 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 I. <laughs> calm down, calm down. Congratulations. Your wife has just given birth to a bouncing baby boy. A boy? Yes! <laughs> oh, God! Oh, God! Where is the nurse? Uh, nurse! Uh, nurse! Can, can I see her now? Oh, 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 God. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Do you want to make it public? No, 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 no. no Alright, I'm sorry about that, okay? Alright. Can't we just go on and, you know, make plans on how to read the wheel? Because my, my uncle is on my neck. This man. I have what it takes to buy you more time. I never have a physical structure. That will enable me to clear his doubt. I need that boy to at least get two years old. Two years old? Yes. Two years old. Come on. What are you talking about? Two years two years is too much. Do, 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 do you want my uncle to? Bro, listen to me. Two years is two years is just but two days in the sight of God. Come on, let us celebrate. No, 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 come on. Then I will tell you that. Yeah, hello, Desmond. Um, your entire family arrived in my office as I talked to you, waiting for you for the reading of your late father's will. Oh, all right, all right, all right. I thought as much. I thought as much. Um, okay. That's okay. That's okay. Alright, alright then, um, we'll expect you in the jiffy. Alright. Uh, he's already on his way. 
barrister. Barrister. If you take a proper look at me, spiritually and physically, you will realize that I'm, I'm an old man. You will realize that I am an old man. Chief, I have never seen where a wealthy man's will is being read in, in, in a rigid office like yours. Look at cobweb everywhere. All I could do there in an office. This is the place where you have brought me to read the, the will of my late brother. Yes, I'll put the, oh, this one. Um, um, yeah, um, yeah. um, 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 so, you wait behind me. You wait behind me. Open all the love I had on you. Open, I've been trying to show you the real love I had on you. You wait behind me and connive with this foreign chip liar. Excuse me, sir. Please don't, uh, don't excuse me. Don't excuse me. My husband, please, let's just allow the barrister to do his work, please. I don't know why you hate you to wear me now. Please hold it. Mother, no, hold it. You are a woman. What do you know about, about a tradition? Uncle, please act mature. Act mature for Christ's sake, okay? This is no traditional whatever. Hello, wake up. Act civil and allow the law to take its place. Mm. Gosh. All right, all right. Um, with all due respect, Sir, I want to remind you that you are sitting right in my office. And I'm not going to sit down here and watch you rain insults on me. Don't force me to use the law on you, or better still, throw you out of my office. Tell him. Thank you, lawyer. Um, Vivian, thank you for insulting me. Vivian, why you were also, why are you sitting, Professor? Vivian, thank you for insulting me. So I am not civilized, Vivian. I am not civilized. I am not my church. All right, um, without wasting any more time, this is your late father's view. This is your late husband's view. This is your brother's view. I know. But I will not read this view at the absence of one person. So please, you have to permit me to invite Miss Gloria Williams. Um, Gloria, please call me. Vanessa! Vanessa! No! Vanessa! 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 Who is this? This! Who is this? Vivian! And even you, Donald! Is this a kind of joke or what? Excuse me! Excuse me, is there something I am missing here? Do you know this people?
Oh Mary full of grace, the Lord is with you. Father, blessed are thou among you. Father, Father, let's go. Father, 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 Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Father, Father, Father. Father. Je crois que c'est à l'autre bout de ce que vous faites. Voilà. Je suis obligé. Voilà. 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 Before I regard it as a polite insult. <clears throat> it's alright. You might still have some light at the end of your dark pitch tunnel all the same. Really? Come on, do not tell me. Do not tell me I want to hear. Calm it. down. Calm down before you scare away the solution. On a more confidential note, I don't want you to view my suggestion or either see me as an antichrist or some sort of demon. Come on, we're adults, right? There's no kid in here. I want to hear it. I want to hear that. All right. All what right. you have in mind. All right. All right. Have you considered? Um, Val Phillips. Para Phillips, yeah. Para Phillips meets barrister donor, a legal practitioner. Um, he always calls me for advice whenever he has some bordering issues. Barrister donor, meet Father Phillips. My pleasure.
Good to see you. Thank you, thank you very much. Well, Mr. Donald, you see a duty call. Yes, Pedro. Mm -hmm. And um, Father Phillips, why don't you go downstairs? Let me just change up our journey. Okay, so, All right, bless you, Father. Bless you, Father. Bless you, Father. All right, um, Father Phillips, my pleasure once again. Have a nice day. So tell me, tell me. Now, let me go straight to the point. Have you considered artificial insemination? Lord of Jesus. Holy Mary. Artificial insemination? Yes, of course. Like taking my sperm? Fix it into a woman to give you a child. Holy Mary. How can you have such thought in your mind as a Christian? God. I pray that our merciful Father have mercy upon you. You know what? You know what, Mr. Donald? Get up and leave my house because you are a bad influence on me. was a friend I can confide in. How can you have such thought in your mind as a Christian? God have mercy upon you. That's what this is doing. Oh, no, please, no, don't do this to us. <laughs> oh, no. Thank you. 